Xavier Giannoli. Uh, the title of my film is The Apparition. It's very difficult to answer. Uh, I don't know if a director can say what his film is about because, uh, you know, I think I'm making films trying to understand what the film is about because uh, most of the time in my films the beginning is in the newspaper, you know, I read a short story and I don't know why I, I'm obsessed with this short story. All the time is the same story, but I don't know why exactly and I'm writing and I'm meeting a lot of people, I'm reading a lot of books, I'm scouting a lot of places, you know, and I think that th this kind of investigation is to discover why this topic is obsessing me, you know, so I don't know exactly what the film is about, you know, maybe faith. I want des facts, des preuves. pour accepter ce que j'ai vu. Oh, at the, at, the, at the very beginning, I just read in your newspaper a short story about a canonic investigation. And I was wondering, what is a canonic investigation? Is it only for church? Or do they give a chance to truth? You know, and uh, I read a lot of things about it. Uh, I read a very strange book called Medjugorje, story of a lie. And Medjugorje is a little town in, up in Yugoslavia where it's supposed to have had a, a very important apparition. And there is thousands of pilgrims now arriving there. And the books was very tough with the apparition, saying that everything is a lie. And, uh, but someone, something catched me about why there is a lot of sincere people coming in this place, why they need to believe in, in this. So I tried to, to meet a lot of people, some priests, some bishops, some journalists, some uh, anthropological, you know, and, and, uh, and I talk, like a journalist, I talk with a lot of people trying to understand what are these investigations, and there is a secret around this investigation. And someday someone just gave me some paper with all the questions that you have to ask to someone who pretend to have an investigation. And, and it was so only facts, you know, and it was so poetic to imagine that you ask this kind of question to someone who pretend that she or he is so good. And uh, it was already cinema, you know, it was already something very simple about fact, but dealing with the most important mystery of humanity, you know, uh, faith, death, God. And so I, I was trying to, to find a way in all these topics. The whole idea of the film was simple. It was, I want to make this film about an apparition so it was completely crazy, you know. But I want to make it here and now, not many years ago. I want to try to deal with, with the world I'm living in. And the first image of the film, it's uh, people uh, speaking Arabian, you know, it's talking about ISIS, you know, and there is a bomb attack. And the end of the film, I don't spoil the end of the film, but there is a desert with a church in the desert with something about eternity you know, and, uh, and about what all these religions are about. And uh, for me, I'm sure that what was very important, it was for me to try to reappropriate something about intimacy, about this question of religion and faith. And so there is social and political issues but the story of my film is the story of a man who is going to discover in himself a doubt. He got no answer, of course not. I'm not stupid, I'm not, I don't want to give an answer about this question, you know, but, but he's, feeling, he's feeling something new and he's feeling something more. And he's opening his eyes and his earth 
to the mystery of this young woman and what she's believing. When I was shooting the, the, the last scene of the film, you know, in, in the desert where my journalist is finding a strange lost church, you know, and uh, I realized why maybe I've done this film, because just I, I wanted to feel something, I, I wanted to try to be in peace with the fact that we can't know, we, we have no answer. A modern faith is that you choose, you believe or you don't believe. But that's the, exactly the opposite of what fanatic and Islamist is. You don't have choice, you must believe. No, I think exactly the opposite. I think that a modern Christian uh, or, or modern Muslim, maybe, he can decide he believe. And uh, I think that when you feel that in your heart, there is a light. And uh, I was trying to make this film to, to find this little light, you know, and, and, and I'm, I was trying to be very modest, you know, and, 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 uh, and just to feel something deep about peace in front of this mystery. Okay, I will not have the answer, but I, have in, I am in peace with this mystery. Uh -huh.